Hello everyone, it's Elder here. Today I wanted to go ahead and review this pie iron uh, made by a company called Rome Cookware. They've been making these since 1964 and are uh, pretty much the originators. Uh, this is actually a double, all right, so you can fit, uh, let's say, double the portion compared to their standards, or if you're like me, you could actually fit one regular portion. And uh, sometimes that's just for beginners, right? Uh, especially when uh, the goodies are start coming out of here and uh, you just don't want to stop eating. I was first exposed to this uh, as a Boy Scout. I was working as a camp counselor and one of the other counselors, we were hanging out at night around the fire, went into his tent, pulled this out. We had borrowed uh, some bread and cheese from uh, the uh, mess hall and uh, went ahead and uh, made some grilled cheeses in here. And man, that was the best grilled cheese that I had had in my life up to that point. Uh, so once again, became something that was very, very memorable. Those of you that know me and are familiar with Natural Training Center know how much, in, uh, how much I prize my Dutch oven and Dutch oven cooking. And uh, once again, keeping uh, within the same theme, because this is 100% cast iron, uh, you can tell that this is definitely something that, uh, that I enjoy using, both when I'm in a camping situation and, of course, while I'm at home. So the front part of this is 100% uh, solid cast iron. As I'd mentioned, I'm not crazy about the fact that it's from China, but uh, looking around, we really don't have that many choices. And as far as the spec goes, it's uh, pretty good to go keeps uh, the price down also and uh, other aspects of it okay we have these chrome rods that are holding it together what I do like because those of you that know about uh, uh, cast iron if you take care of it and take care of your cookware it'll last forever all right I'm not really too sure about these rods or any of these type of rods of course because you're creating a big lever here with a lot of weight I think uh, the manufacturer states that this is about five pounds all right so you're on a long lever here um, so once again who knows uh, I've had this for a while but you know and it's been doing uh, quite well. But my point is that there are a couple pins here, all right, a couple of these cotter pins that you could kind of pull out and replace if you have to down the line. So that way, if you had do have this for a few years and it's seasoned well, and you know, those of you that know, the more you use cast iron, it just seems like the better it tastes and the better that it cooks. Um, so when you do have it for a few years and you, the last thing you want to do is have to replace it uh, when it's nice and serviceable just because of the rods. So as I mentioned, you have your uh, chrome rods here, you have your wooden handle, you have a uh, bit of a lockdown over here, all right, to keep your uh, cover closed, all right, the cast iron part in the front, all right, and uh, you know, once again, this is kind of heavy here, so I don't, you're not going to sit here like you're uh, roasting marshmallows. So this is really designed to put into the actual fire, into your coals, and uh, make sure that uh, depending on what you're cooking, right, it's endless, the recipes, uh, you could pretty much uh, think of something and there'll be a way to make it in here, right? Uh, so, uh, you know, you're limited to your imagination is basically the point that I'm trying to make. Um, <clears throat> take care of this the same way that you would any other uh, cast iron, all right? Making sure that you're seasoning it, keeping soap away, you know, all the other good stuff. Once again, this is a review, not a tutorial. So when you open it up, what's cool too is this does come apart into two pieces. So if you just wanted to use them as individual skillets, all right, for multi-purpose, multitask, especially if we're thinking about an emergency situation and you're limited on things to bring, once again, you do have the weight, right? But if you are staying in at home or using your vehicle, this is definitely something to consider because it's all contained and uh, in this one little piece, okay, once you put it together and you have pretty much your whole kitchen right there in a pinch. Uh, with very tasty meals and at the same time which i've addressed many times when it comes to cast iron you're not going to get the uh, toxic chemicals seeping into your good food that you would in something that's made of uh, of aluminum or other type of, of material all right that's causing all sorts of havoc on our ner nervous system every day you know science is coming up with something new of this toxicity poison that we're getting that's seeping in from our cookware uh, once again with cast iron we don't have to worry about that because if the iron does seep into the food it's actually good for you so it's a good thing. So keep that in mind. We need our immu immune system good to go in any type of uh, emergency situation because it's already going to get whacked enough uh, from all the stress that's going on because of the emergency, si uh, emergency situation. As you can tell by my hands, just handling on the outside here, 
right? Uh, I don't take too much. I'll dust it off once I take it out of the fire and, you know, leave it to cool off. I'll dust it off before I put it away. But always look into some kind of carrying case. I'd like to recommend a carrying case, right? Like always, I'll put all the specs and weight and size and all that in the blog post. So make sure you check that out if you're interested. Also, where you could pick one of these up uh, relatively inexpensively. Uh, but also, when I was looking at the covers that were available, the covers were actually more expensive than the actual pie iron. Uh, and, you know, once again, just as long as you can put something, right, that'll keep this away from the rest of the gear. I right, brought up the grilled cheeses. I mean, you can do anything from various desserts to empanada type stuff to burrito type stuff to um, desserts, right? Obviously, it's called a pie iron, right? So you can make all sorts of pies, be as creative as you want, use pre-made dough, uh, create your own dough. Once again, depending on your time, your application, and of course, your skill set. All right, so uh, I've made of uh, all of the above and then some, right? Because a lot of times you want to make something, you open up the fridge or open up the cupboard, and the exact ingredients that you wanted aren't there, but something else comes into your imagination, and you go outside and try it. That's how we learn, and sometimes that's how we come up with our best recipes. So, uh, you know, once again, uh, I gave you all the features, all the good points. The price is uh, good to go, all right? You're looking at under, you know, let's say 20, 22 bucks, something like that, shipped. All right, so... Uh, you know, that's, that's not a bad deal at all, considering that there is some weight to this. Um, once again, the durability factor, uh, you're gonna treat it just like you would any other cast iron as far as care and handling. Uh, so we stop it from cracking and dropping and things of that nature. Okay, I uh, went over the handles. And of course, like we always spoke about with the emergency uh, application, since that's a big focus what, what we, with, uh, what, what, that we concentrate on with our reviews. Uh, once again, not for uh, carrying, let's say on your person, but on your vehicle or staying in at home, this is definitely a viable solution, not only for the nutrition, not only for the tastiness, but also bringing your little, your family together, your smaller tribe together, right? Sitting around the fire in these stressful situations and giving them a bit of comfort, right? So, uh, you know, let's not uh, forget about that. You know, mental aspect of things is uh, make or break when it comes to emergency and survival, especially with those that we love, our loved ones, right? That we want to take extra care for. Uh, so these little things might make all the difference in the world. Keep that in mind. All right. Hope you enjoyed this review and found it useful. Once again, this is Helder. Stay motivated.